Hey folks, this is D Lo back with Game with another video and uh whew, Lord have mercy. Boy, if I didn't see his archive, I would never would believe it. And I'll put make sure to put this link to his archive in the description box. So a woman with turns for vacation and find her land at home demolished. She came home and found her home destroyed. And come to find out, y'all, it was a company that did this to her home. A brand company that did this to her home. So there's a video to this article. Let's I, I, let's 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 listen to this. Unforgivable accident. That's how one homeowner describes coming back from vacation to find a company accidentally demolished a home she owned. Company management claims they had the wrong address. Fox says Eric Perry has been digging into this issue. He's live for us with the latest. So, Eric, how does this even happen? Yeah, Alex, that's really the million dollar question. Take a look. This is all that is left of this home. Thankfully, no one lived inside at the time, but it's a home that's been in the family for over four decades. I'm just left with a big old mess. Susan Hodgson can't even begin to process how her longtime family property ended in a pile of rubble. It started while she was on vacation and received a call from a neighbor. Did you hire somebody to tear your house down next door to me? That's been boarded up for about 15 years. And I said, uh, no, no. She said, well, there's somebody over here just demolished the whole house and tore the whole house down. Hodgson says the workers got nasty. He told her to shut up and mind her own business. So she sent a family member over. Said, well, look, I'm going to see a permit. Okay, let's stop right there, y'all. How he going to tell her to shut my home business? The, the fact that she, uh, uh, that neighbor, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, the fact that he, that she, uh, this uh, person bought this concern, the end thing that that woman might have said may have killed him, or whoever worked for that company that, hmm, we might be doing this to the wrong house. Did he even look at his surroundings that may indicate that he in the wrong house? Maybe to get back to destroy the wrong house or something? First of all, I don't think he had no business telling her to mind her, uh, uh, mind, mind her own business because let's just say, and this is just my opinion, if she happened to told him something, let him know anything, he should actually to consider uh, what she said and maybe we'll not hmm. Maybe we doing this to the wrong house. Or anyway, anybody, and plus, somebody correct me in the conversation. Don't those people have to uh, make sure they had to uh, make sure they had to look up the wild address to make sure they had the white house before they just going around destroying it. Okay, get back to this. Or something. They said, okay. Uh, he pulls it out. He says, oh, I'm at the wrong address. And just packs everything up and leaves and the house is deported. <laughs> the Lord have mercy. <laughs> I don't mean to laugh, but Jesus Christ. Let's continue. I, I can't. I can't say nothing at the moment about that. Uh, uh, mm -mm. Gone. The home sits on Lake Avenue in southwest Atlanta, and no one was living inside at the time. It's been boarded up for about 15 years. And we keep it boarded up, the grass cut, the yards cleaned up. Uh, Texas 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 says she hasn't heard anything from the company responsible. You call it, we haul it, and it's based in Atlanta. Uh, it's just hard to believe somebody just thinks they can got the right just to come up and tear something up and just walk away from it and leave it. And no, come back say, I'm sorry. I, you know, I, what do y'all need to do to fix this? You know, it's an accident. And, and now. Oh, it's just a, dump, a rumble mess. That whole house is just deported and just crushed in. Hodgson and her family has to figure out what to do next. I think he owes us an apology and 
fix the problem. He needs to fix the problem. All right, back out here live. I did reach out to the company and got a response. I'm told that this under investigation. They also said they're working to rectify the situation. Now, the family involved says they have not heard from the company at all. Hopefully, they can get some answers after this. They're also worried about any maybe water or gas lines that might have been possibly ruptured. They just honestly do not know at this moment. Of course, we'll continue to follow the developments in this story. In Southwest Atlanta, I'm Eric Perry, Fox 5 News. Tragedy, tragedy struck. struck. <laughs> oh, Lord Jesus. Lord have mercy. I, I can't believe those people. <laughs> oh, you know what? When, when they finish doing their investigating, uh, doing their investigation, let me tell you something. If that woman, if she is able to Gather up all the she need to gather up all the evidence she evidence she need, and she need to, she need to sue them people. <laughs> I'm sorry, yo. I know that I don't mean to laugh, but I think I, I'm laughing because this is I I'm more in shock than anything else. That's why I'm laughing because I'm more in disbelief about this situation. How on earth you gonna have to tell somebody to mind their business and then you realize two seconds later you in the wrong house? Oh, uh, didn't anything that woman say or that or uh, did you really look at your surroundings that that, that, that that was that it may may have indicated you that you was at the wrong house? You can't be. I mean, these people can't be serious. This is this is so unbelievable. Now, thanks to those idiots, she ain't got no house no more. Lord have mercy. I can't with this story. I can't with it. <sighs> if there any updates on this story, well, I'll be I, trust me. I will do another video on this, but. In my personal opinion, once the investigation is done, and if, if if she got, she need to gather all the evidence that she can, and if she got a case, I I ain't got no doubt she got a case. She need to go. She need to. She need, she need, she need to sue that company. She need to sue that company down to the T, because especially the fact that they did this and realized it was the wrong house and try to do nothing to. Try to do nothing to whip, whip a man what they done. Oh no. Especially if she said that her house was paid, the taxes, everything on the house paid. Uh oh no. She got a major league lawsuit. That's a major league lawsuit. These people tore down a woman's house and didn't realize to two minutes later they, they tore down the wrong. Jesus Christ. Y'all gonna have to tell me what y'all think about this. Leave your thoughts down below and make sure you share. <laughs> <clears throat> make sure you share these videos. And I would love to know what y'all think on this one. Again, if you're new, subscribe. I do information videos like this on the regular. I, I, I just can't believe this right here. Y'all let me know what y'all think. I'm out.